Port Adelaide fans, what a ripping win that was in the T20 Bushfire Showdown. A 14-run victory and a million dollars raised for the SA Bushfire Appeal. Bloody great result, I reckon that is. Uh, let's check out some of the action that's happening. A lot of players signing, but first guy I want to speak to is a guy by the name of Luke. He is a representative of the Aldinga Beach CFS and part of our team today. G'day, Luke. How are you? How are you, mate? Good, good. Now, mate, uh, the heart rate. You went out and uh, did a little bit of fielding there in uh, our second inning, and, mate, it must have been pumping pretty hard. I was absolutely packing it. I've never played cricket in my life, so... No, you've never picked up a cricket ball? Nah, nah, nah other than mucking around at school. That's, that's there it. you go. Well, the pressure was definitely on. Mate, you're here as a, rep a representative of the CFS today, and really not only Aldinga Beach, but really the CFS at large. Is it pretty buoying in terms of the spirit that, you know, so much has been raised today, so many people turned out to this? Oh, look, it's absolutely amazing what's happened today to see a million dollars raised to go out to the affected areas. Yeah. Um, to see 35,000 people come out and support is amazing. Um, I'm only one representative of, of thousands of, of volunteers that have worked really hard. I think, as TJ said, like all of the Christmas break, um, guys have been out there much more than even what I have. Um, so, yeah, it's been a top effort by the whole state. Mate, you've spent some time at KI and in Cuddly Creek over the last couple of months. Uh, really, there's going to need to be a lot more fundraising done for bushfire efforts. Oh, look, for sure. It's, I mean, it's all going to help. I mean, as a service, you know, we've been really well, but it's, the focus needs to now go on to, to making sure that all those people that are lost, lost their homes, lost their livelihoods, that we get on board and support them. And I guess, hence the uh, book them out and uh, get over and support them wherever we can. Well, thank you so much for your service. Hopefully you had a ripping time with the boys today. Good on you, Luke. I've had the best day. Thanks, mate. <laughs> all right, let's keep moving around here. we got Kane Farrell here. Now, one of Roving Damo's favourites is Dan Houston. Let's see if we can grab him now. He'll be, he'll be excited to speak to us. You know this moment was coming, Dan Houston. Uh, I heard that you subbed in for Todd Marshall because you wanted to speak to me at the end of the game. Yeah, who told you that? I, I don't know, mate. Uh, I, it was just a face. You lit up when you saw me earlier. Yeah, that's right. We always have that connection since the, uh, <laughs> the Virgin Lounge. That's right. Uh, mate, how did it feel being out there today? Yeah, it was good. It was a really good atmosphere, um, and it was good just to get out and get on Adelaide Oval and, and play some uh, some cricket and, and just sort of come out and have a bit of fun and, and for, for a quality cause as well. So oh, for sure, a great day. Mate, uh, were you first sub in? I mean, when Todd came down with General Sauna, so was it always going to be you next? Yeah, I think so. I was not, I've sort of lost my talent, but I thought <laughs> if, I, if I can bowl on the pitch, I'm happy to play. So yeah. um, I was, wasn't, uh, wasn't first in line, but yeah. it was good to get the call up. Uh, mate, uh, who do you think is going to end up with the most overinflated ego after that performance? Well, yeah, I reckon Connor, Connor Rosie is good at everything. <laughs> so he knows he's good already. Social media think, loving him after that catch. I think inflated, maybe Bokey yeah. played pretty well. Even Tom Cleary mate, performed very well. He, uh, he went bunter with the bat. Uh, good game today. Good to have you out Thanks, there. Thanks, Damo. All right, let's see if we can move down. I can see Hammer Hartler in the distance. We've already harassed Trav Boak today, but... As Dan Houston said, what a performance of Trav Boak. Uh, carted Tex Walker for a couple of sixes. What a shame that Tex started to perform late in his innings because we made him look silly earlier. All right, Hammer's down here, signing some autographs for the kids. What a generally likeable guy he is. Hammer, sorry to interrupt. Uh, you, can keep, you can keep signing here. But uh, Hammer, you took out Tex Walker's off stump. Uh, how did that feel? No, that wasn't me. That was uh, TJ. Oh, that was TJ, of course. Yeah. But no, but you took two no, pegs. No, uh, I, I got a, Alex Carey. Alex Carey, of course you did. Uh, <laughs> mate, uh, you, you took out an Australian batter. Yeah. How did that feel? Uh, yeah, it was, oh, it was a pretty nice feel. It wasn't the best delivery. It was, um, <laughs> it was a full oh, half volley sort of outside off stump, and yeah. he just... Um, just clipped the outside of the bat. Uh, Bokey took a nice catch of points. So, no, it was, uh, it was a nice feeling. I actually apologised to him because I wanted him to um, uh, hit a few sixes and, and raise a bit more money for us. But uh. Mate, we spoke at uh, the pre-game on the pitch and really 231 runs. Crows made uh, over 200 as well. Yeah. A million dollars raised. I don't think we could have hoped for much more than that uh, today. It was, it was a great day all around. Uh, weather was fantastic. Um, Great stand of cricket, obviously, from both teams and lots of fun So and, and plenty of money raised, which is um, the most important thing. So it's been a really successful day. Post-career opportunity in cricket then? Not for me. <laughs> not, not, not after what I did today. All right, get back to the fans there, mate. They love you. Let's uh, let's keep moving back this way. We've still got a couple of people up here signing autographs. I reckon I can see Sarah Lowe here. Let's see if we can get her before she turns out. She, of course, joins us from the Adelaide Scorpions, a uh, previous Karen Rolton medalist. 
let's uh, let's have a chat with Sarah. Sarah, if I could grab you for a second, yes. how how was that today? Because I, I'll tell you what, having that huge crowd here must have been a big buzz. That was amazing. Uh, very surreal, standing yeah. out in the middle, having people like Bridget Patterson around. It was a lot of fun, but uh, great day. Matty Crouch seemed like uh, he was going to cause us some troubles early until you dismissed him. Yeah, it was nice nice to get a catch on the boundary, yeah. but um, yeah, just had a great day. So. And how's it been uh, being part of the Port Adelaide Footy Club uh, to wear the colours? It's great. It's been a great day and great to be involved with the team and yeah. the boys have been really good. So, yeah, it's awesome. Oh, it's a pleasure having you involved. Well done today. It has been a ripping day. The fans are still hanging around, getting some side. In fact, before I sign off, we've got to get a word from the captain himself. Tommy Jonas carrying the showdown trophy here of, of a different kind. How good is it to have some more silverware? It's heavy, mate. It's um, a, a trophy's a trophy. I will be keen for a couple of showdown ones during the year, but this is a good start for 2020, so we're not going to complain. Mate, I was just speaking to Hammer before. I wrongly attributed uh, your removal of Tex Walker's off stump to him. Uh, mate, how did that feel? Oh, I needed to do something, so <laughs> I was due. Big Tex cleared the front leg and just yeah. left a little little gap between bat and pad, and I took made the most of it. So, no, nah, it, it was a great day. It was good yeah. fun being out there, and um, the cricket actually wasn't too bad. So, uh, Mate, it was a very good standard, but really the most important thing here, over a million dollar raise for charity. In terms of what we could have wanted for today, that's a pretty good result. In incredible effort. The Aussie yeah. spirit and everyone banding together, Sample, Saka, um, you know, Redbacks boys, Port and Crows, and everyone that turned out today and donated throughout the day. It's just absolutely incredible, and hopefully it goes to people that really need it and it helps, them, helps get them back on their feet. So I'm proud to be a part of it, and everyone that turned up today and helped should be proud as well. Mate, I was going to sign off, but you may as well do it as a captain. We're out. We're out. See you later.